Hello, Facebook world. Today I'm going to talk about Wonder Woman, Cavaliers, and Thrive. Uh, at first I have to put on my headphones. I'm late to the game today. But we are going to chat with a friend of mine. Actually, I met through my Thrive world, and I quickly realized that we have a lot in common. Um, she's going to share her Thrive experience today and a couple of our, our shared loves. Um, but once she jumps on, we're going to talk about her Thrive experience. So uh, Thrive is three simple steps. First thing in the morning, we take one to two capsules on an empty stomach. 20 to 40 minutes later, we drink an ultra micronized lifestyle mix, which is, I was just telling somebody the other day, like, it's like the second half of your vitamins. It literally is. Instead of taking 15 capsules, we take two and then this mix. And then we put on our little DFT, which stands for Dermafusion Technology, um, and that delivers vitamins slowly throughout your day. One, two, three, and done in your first 30 minutes of your day, which I love most um, about my Thrive. So I am going to grab Miss Devin. She's out there. There she is. And she's going to chat with us a little bit about experience. But the most fun part of my Thrive is... Hi! Yay, it worked. I was just going to say the most fun thing about thriving is you meet people. Devin's from Vermont, from all over the all over the country, all over the world. And you realize, oh my gosh, how many things we have in common. So we love Wonder Woman. <laughs> and <laughs> and we have we both have a Cavalier King Charles. I saw yours on Facebook today. Yeah. What are you guys doing over there today? Uh, we've just been hanging kind of low since Holly had her surgery. So, yeah. yeah, my dog had her leg amputated. So it's been a rough couple days. I know. I was going to so. ask you, how come? I don't think I caught why. Um, when we got her, she was a rescue. So she was one of many that had been, you know, neglected, abused. She was about four and a half, five months old, hadn't had food, never been outside. Um, but she had been physically abused. So we've been looking out for that leg that just never kind of healed right. And there's just so much damage to it that now that she's two, today's her birthday, um, the vet said, now's the time. And it was beyond repair to do surgery. So they just amputated. But she's doing good. She's doing good. Yeah. Dogs don't, dogs aren't vain. No. <laughs> That's what I always remember. <laughs> I used to rescue, we used to do like um, fostering for Cavaliers. And we had one that its leg like grew underneath. Um, oh. And the same thing, the person who adopted her just had it removed and she yeah. lived a great life. But, yep. you know, people were so into like looks. Everybody was like, I can't look at her. And yeah. I was like, she's fine. She doesn't yeah. notice. I know. I walked into the room to, you know, she was coming out of anesthesia and I'm like, I didn't even look. I didn't want to see it. But yeah. Well, but you've now, given now her we such a good life. That's amazing. Like, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and she's totally recovering amazingly. That's so yeah. incredible. Yeah. Awesome. Is. So what I really brought you on here for was to talk about your Thrive experience. Can you tell me a little bit about um, just Thrive, where you were before it, and, and a little bit about how it started for you? Um, before Thrive, I think I was like many of us. I was tired. I was constantly wanting to lose weight. I was constantly wanting to feel better. Um, but I was a busy mom of three kids who had me running everywhere. I ran my own business, so I was exhausted all the time. There was absolutely no possible me time where I could either work out or go to the gym. Um, you know, we were constantly on the go. So eating healthy wasn't always an option. I felt in my mind, I justified everything by, <laughs> you know, we have no time. Um, and I just, I don't know. I had kind of accepted that this was how life was supposed, you know, this is how it's going to be. Like, this is the normal. Um, stop complaining about everything it just sucks. And that's just the way <laughs> right? it is. This is how it is once you have kids and yeah. you get old. <laughs> yep. Yeah. The aches and the pains, you know, at 34, yep. the doctor started saying, well, that comes with age. And I'm like, I'm 34. Like that's <laughs> not with age in my opinion. But so I brushed that off too. Like, okay, I'm just getting old and, and I was miserable. So then my friend Kim had been thriving and um, she gave me a sample, a three-day sample. In the first three days, I didn't feel a difference, uh, but I had lost four pounds, which I had been using another supplement at the time and hadn't seen results for over a year. So I should have been like, yep, ordering, but I'm stubborn. <laughs> and I didn't. Um, I was like, ah, thanks, but no thanks. And it was probably almost 
it had to have been close to a year later that I was like, okay, now I've done it, you know, a year with the same thing with no results. So let's try it again. Um, day one, I didn't really feel anything because I didn't really feel it on the other day either. Um, by day three, again, I dropped about three to four ish pounds. Um, but it was probably day 10 to like going into like the third week that I really noticed. Um, it kind of hit me. I just felt better. Like I would be doing dishes in the kitchen and I would be singing and dancing around the kitchen the way my mom would do when I was a kid. And I thought, okay, like that's new. <laughs> that, that doesn't usually happen when I'm cleaning the house. Right. Um, and also I would uh, have a lot of aches and pains and I noticed I wasn't having them and they were normal for me. And I was like, huh, I wonder if it's the Thrive. And I can tell you a year and a half later, it sure is because, you know, it is just that. It was that simple for me. Like the little aches and pains that became a normal day-to-day -day occurrence, they just weren't anymore. Um, yeah. They were gone. And I started getting more energy. Um, I was at a point where I had kind of burnt out with my job. And since I started Thrive, it is like a whole new career all over again. Um, I have the energy to wake up in the morning at 4.30 and I get my workout in and I shower before my day starts. I have energy to keep up with the kids all day long and their whining doesn't drive me crazy and make me hate <laughs> my life. Um, right. and then after work, I cart my daughter to whatever dance class we have that night. And generally I get a second workout in, I cook dinner, I clean up the house and you know, and then when I hit the bed, I fall asleep and get a great night's sleep. I don't toss and turn and I'm ready to jump up and do it all over again. It's, it's pretty awesome. I can not imagine ever not using my three steps ever. Yeah. I love so, that. It's yeah. I always, I always love when people basically describe your day as being what we all want in a day, but it sounds normal, but truthfully, most of us are, you know, we have aches and pains and mm -hmm. like, I used to wake up with a backache that would just drive me wild every morning. I would get up earlier and earlier. And when that disappeared, I was like, that is crazy. Um, yeah. better sleep, better mood, just little things that add up to, um, big things. Yep. Mm -hmm. And it's funny you mentioned the back pain because with Holly having her surgery on Thursday, we've been kind of lugging her down the stairs up to wherever she is. And she's about 65, 68 pounds. So I woke up today and my back was killing me. And I thought, I'm going to put my DFTs there today. And I'm not even joking. Within 30 minutes, the pain was gone. <laughs> I, don't even, I don't even know how. And I went for like a three mile walk outside with my other dog and no pain. And I was like, I yeah, I was, I was impressed. <laughs> I know, impressed. right? I know. Sometimes we're like, yeah, it really does work <laughs> after yeah. all these years for me. I love it. Awesome. Well, thanks yeah. for sharing. Oh, you're and um, tell me, business wise, what kind of got you thinking that direction? I know that's the piece that everybody's like, sure. Um, I'm, I'm sure you and I both were like, yeah, I'll try that. I'll order that, but I'm never going to sell it. I'm not going to do that. <laughs> yes. Well, and that is so true. And I said that to Kim, I'm like, well, I'm going to buy from you, but I sell something else. So just so you know, I'm never <laughs> posting about it. I'm never telling people that I use it. Um, but it was like that third weekend when I noticed the energy and the aches and pains were gone that I thought I have so many friends and family members and um, people in my life that I know would benefit from this. And I, it's like, it's free to promote it. Um, you know, the website is free and my, the other thing I was doing certainly was not free. Um, there was no quotas that I had to hit. It was just simply use the products and share your love for them. And then I have only paid for thrive three times because when you refer to people, you get your product for free. So I think in the last year and a half, I've paid twice for my thrive. Like yeah. it's, you know, it just, it only made sense to, I wanted everybody to feel the way that I felt. Yeah. And that's yeah. the coolest part is you genuinely are, are talking to your, you know, your closest friends, your family members, your significant others. Those are the people that we, we look at first with our product, yep. which I think is so telling because it works. We really want people to feel good. Yeah. Like we do. Awesome. Is, that's what it was about. It really, really was. Yeah. I mean, it wasn't about, you know, oh, I'm going to make all of this money, which you could. Yeah. And it wasn't about, you can earn all of these trips, which you can. 
Um, yeah. You know, it was just, I want her to feel as good as I feel, you know? Totally. Um, totally. Because it, it, it went into it, it thinking that. Yeah. And it went from me, okay, I want to lose weight and be skinny to I want to be healthy and feel amazing and be the best mom I can be. So yes. it was just so a complete true. mind shift, complete mind so, shift. So true. So true. And I was a, a supplement junkie prior and, you know, so many times it was hard to explain to my children why I wasn't eating meals, why I was yeah. skipping things and that's the piece I love about Thrive is I still eat three meals a day. I'm, you know, showing my kids what it looks like to be healthy, mm -hmm. happy, working out to feel my best, not necessarily to be skinny. Because I do think yeah. as women that that's why I started. I thought I need I need to be skinny. Yeah. <laughs> yep. I think we'll always have 10 pounds to lose in our brains. But um, that piece of health is so much more important the older we get. Yeah. Yeah, it's so true. I always look back at pictures and I'm like, I wish I could be as fat as I thought I was. You know, back then I thought I was fat. I wish I could be that fat again. Like, it's but, so true. It's yeah, so true. We're our like, worst critics, you know? Right. I know. I love that part of it is you really start to realize that happiness, contentness, patience, all of those things are so much more important um, than a number yes. on a scale. Yeah. Yep. Love it. hundred well, percent. Thank you for sharing. Oh, thank and you for having me. And if you guys have questions or comments for Devin or I, just message us. Um, I think her story is so great because a lot of times as moms, we, we think we have it all together and we think what is normal is crabby, sleepy, uh, you know, aches and pains, but there is, there's a different way. And that's the part I love so much. Yeah. Awesome. Well, thanks for jumping on, right. and I hope you have a great rest of your Sunday. All right. You too. Bye, guys. Yeah. Thanks, Megan. Bye, guys.